Hello guys, welcome to Trading Home and in today's tutorial we're doing something very very interesting. Alright, so if you're tired of modeling, let's say objects or furniture from scratch, okay? If you're tired of doing that and you want maybe a ready-made door, this video is actually for you because I'll be showing you guys how to do that in a very few steps, okay? So, if you check very well, you see that this door is a kicker door, okay? It's still fine, but if you look at this other one, this one looks more real, okay? Looks like all these modern doors. So if you want to get ready-made doors, you want to get different types of doors, components, let's say car porch and everything, anything you want to get, I'll be taking you on how to get that on these few steps, okay? So we're getting them from 3D Warehouse. I'll be showing you how to get it from there and how to, you know, um, reduce, um, like to step it down a little and then bring it into a key card so that you can, you know, fasting your work instead of modeling this door you can actually get it very fast okay so let's dive in without wasting much of your time so the first thing you need to do make sure you have internet yeah because that was very very necessary we need that so we can open our browsers okay so turn on your internet and now let's minimize this one okay and open your you know your browser open your browser let's proceed let's proceed let's proceed okay so now type in your 3d warehouse <laughs> what am i typing type in your 3d warehouse okay 3d warehouse I already have it here because i've been you know i've been using it for a while now so after you type in your 3d warehouse search for it please this thing shouldn't take much time okay click on the 3d warehouse let's go together let me show you guys you can already see some things here are showing you can see chairs and the rest and the rest and the rest okay if you have any other thing you might want us to you know try or just type you know mention it on the comment section for this one what do you think we should get um since we already have a door let's try something okay let's try something or should let's just search for door let's search for door the most time doors comes in uh, group forms so let's try that so we can you can see some components already you can see some things and the rest okay so let me show you what to do now once you come here just type in what you want type in what you want let's say security door yeah let's try this security door i'm going to see a couple of them you'll see a couple of them sorry my internet is a bit low slow okay 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 security door come on okay you can see security doors all right you can see security doors you can see security doors so now what you need to do just select that particular one you want you can search if you don't see the one you like here you can you know screw all the way down load more and then check out those doors check out those doors check out those doors so for this one let's pick this um this one then this one is kind of cool let's pick this one click on it okay click on the door and then let me show you something if you want to get something similar you see related content okay let's try and see i hope this one gives us something even more better than this um let's wait a bit let's wait a bit it's still loading it's still loading it's still loading so now or should we just go ahead and download this one okay okay um these ones are still cool but i think let's go with this one so what you need to do now is click on download okay once you click on download there's collada file there's sketchup file okay so click on sketchup file okay click on sketchup file click on sketchup file click on sketchup file i know some will be like you see it's downloading already okay if you check here you can see it's still downloading some person will be like what if the doors are in different you know we have like three doors together or four doors together and i just want to pick one particular one that i like inside um those doors you want to i want to pick one of those doors okay inside the group doors now let me show you what to do okay so this one is done downloading so let's go back a little let me show you something very very amazing if you check out this one you can see we have two doors we have the big one and the smaller door okay so i click on this one let me show you something which is very very key all right let me show you something so now I click on download Let's download this one so that you know what to do when you have 
different components different you know doors and windows in one file and you want to select just one to archicad because if you take only this one if you take this file to archicad the entire thing will follow and there's no way you can separate them there in archicad okay so that's why i'm trying to you know download this one too so that we can we can try the two okay please come on download download um hope it's not the internet okay why is it slow resuming i shall hope my internet for some of you that have wi-fi congratulations to you <laughs> so let's try and get it why is this thing this slow now come on Come on, we don't have much time. Let's just try downloading again. Let's close and then try downloading again and see. This need to be fast. Okay. Security door zero one escaping. Let's close this one. Resuming. But you know what? I have some couple of them. This is where to download, okay? This is where to download. I guess my internet is shaking. It's, it's actually raining. It has started raining. So I think maybe that's the reason. My internet is not that strong. So now what we need to do now, okay? Since we've downloaded one already, which is this one, okay? Let's go check it out. Let me just close this one. Like this. Now, go to your files. Where you normally save, where your downloads actually save. So check down, you can see security door. Copy this security door, okay? You can open it here, you can, you know, you can copy it to somewhere else. So let's just create, let's say we have a folder outside here, okay? Let's say we have a folder, let's say real. Let's say the folder name is real, okay? So click inside and, you know, paste, paste it here sorry if the rain noise is affecting okay i'll try to be very loud so so that you can hear what i'm saying so now another key important thing you need to note is that you need to have um you need to have sketchup in your system installed okay you need to have sketchup installed because most of these um sketchup files most of these things we are downloading from 3d warehouse some of them have been um modeled with higher versions of sketchup so you need to open it and step it down to a version of sketchup that archicad can open okay which is very very important so now i'm going to open this since i have sketchup already so i can actually open this all right so install sketchup let me see which of the sketchup am i using this is sketchup 23 okay so let's try and um, open this particular file okay open with sketchup application yeah Is, is opening let me off my internet since i'm no longer using it okay this file you can see the file okay this and this and that the security door is currently locked by another user okay i think i i, I opened this twice okay all right so now you can see the door this is just a simple door shower you can see the door here okay can see the door this one is single so all you need to do right now is just go to file click on save as save the name you can let's say um a door a door let's this let this one be capital later let's say a door and save it as what ketchup 19 2019 okay save it as 2019 save now let me open one of my um sketchup libraries let me open something you know let me try to get something more um complicated so that you can oh this is let's try um sketch up okay materials um let's see wine glass this one is big actually so <laughs> let's use this one this is wine glass you can see the wine 
this thing the glass is here so let's say for instance you want to pick just one glass from here now i'm just giving you an instance right let's say you want to pick just one here and and you have all these things inside and you just want to pick only one only one so what you need to do is click on that particular one okay let's carry this rule just this rule let's carry just this rule okay and then what we'll do now is we'll click on this and control c we'll copy this one open a new sketch up okay because you can't delete the other one because you may need them later okay sorry because you may need them later so now let's open a new um sketch up okay open a new sketch up and then we're going to be pasting this inside all right paste it inside under this millimeter just click inside and so it's advisable you get the sketch up installed in your system okay so now let's remove this one and paste paste this here okay so you can see the wine glass now so we're going to save this as again okay save as still on that our same listing real folder and this the first one was a, a door and then this one let's just say glass okay um glass cup and then don't forget to select 2019 okay sketch out 2019 and save so i think we are good to go now so the only thing we need to do now is go back to your key card okay just go back to your key card click on floor plan once you click on floor plan go back to that your folder okay your real folder okay your real folder here's the real folder and then this door click on it and drag to to a key card then drop it here it's loading okay okay so let's click now let's just drop it here okay you can see where the door is that's funny so all we need to do now is just highlight the door okay highlight the door and um there's something i like doing which i think is helpful just click on this your line select the rectangle and but before then let's first of all rotate this one okay let's rotate the door let's rotate the door okay so now we'll still work on it in case it doesn't come out well so now pick your rectangle and highlight this select everything and group them together okay so that when you pick this rectangle it will okay, let me remove it from this suspend group so now once i click on this rectangle it will automatically select the door okay so what we'll be doing now let's check our 3d click on 3d and you see the door is there looking at you look at the door here this is the door so you can click the door move it and bring it to that point you want to fix the door okay bring it to the point you want to fix the door you can see that we have the door here now and you can decide to take it up so this is how to bring component okay and for the other one that we've grouped already okay the one we've grouped um for the one we've grouped you can still bring it so this is how i brought the, this other door you're seeing so this is it and if you want to adjust yeah let me show you something which is very very important let's take this one down okay let's take this one down and then you can still stretch the door a bit you can stretch the door by um let's see let's go back to let's suspend this and see yeah make sure it's on okay once you select this upper one you can see this this stretch height click on it so now you can bring the door down you can take it up okay you can see you can take it up you can take it down so let's bring it to this level and click and then click on this same point again let's select this other one now like this this one move let's see if we can uh, no if it's not working let's go back to floor plan and try it there okay go back to floor plan where is our door this is our door click on this one okay so here you can stretch the door you can stretch it on the floor plan okay can stretch it i haven't decided to maybe move it to the side like it's opening but it's how to insert your door if you check your 3d now you discover that it's actually here okay 
is actually here it's actually here and for the glass since we've separated them already what you can do is just come here and still drag this glass cup to your archi card oh, if, okay let's see if it's going to work on 3d but well, it doesn't seem like it's working so let's just click on floor plan and um use floor plan um drag it from here and then take it to floor plan and paste you can see the glass cup here click it's loading it's loading yeah so here is the club here's the the glass now okay now let's check our 3d you can see that particular glass here okay I decide to take it up by clicking on it and then taking this one this is still on move on um, stretch so just click on this and take it either up up like this or down okay so it depends on where you want to paste it you can use either elevation or use um section or cut through it depends on where you're pasting it okay depends on where you're pasting. you click on south elevation and you can still see it here let's extend this line let's extend this line this is glass so once you click on it you can move it up from here to any position of your choice okay any position of your choice so this is how to move components ready-made components okay or furniture same the same way you can the same way we move this um the glass and um, the door the same way you can move cars you can move humans you can move buildings you can move just follow that same steps okay so I feel it's helpful to do this tutorial and that's why I'm dropping it, okay? And if this video is helpful to you, please don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share, don't forget to like, and don't forget to comment, okay? Drop more ideas, let's look out for more videos to do, okay? So thank you so much, see you on our next tutorial. Bye.